the anticipation. Are you ready? Are we ready, John? Can we run? <laughs> oh, there you go. That's, yeah, we got it. I'm just making up for the fact it didn't work earlier. Yeah, you can probably stop now, Polly. <laughs> yeah. It was a thought. Look, oh, okay, look, you look beautiful. He doesn't flinch. He's still <laughs> smiling. Uh. <laughs> nice <laughs> nose action now. You look really happy, actually. <laughs> <laughs> look at his face. <laughs> It's almost like he's used to it. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God, you're in good sport. Absolutely. That is fantastic. Yeah, just fill his ear up there. Like, that will probably go on for a while. because When his brain's full, it'll come out the other end. Like. <laughs> <laughs> Absolutely amazing. That is fantastic. Oh, brilliant. Let's hear Thanks it for it. our contestants, ladies and gentlemen. Let's give them both a goodie bag, please. Don't go anywhere. Yeah, well done to both of you. Well done to both of you guys. Way. And that Thank amazing cam with a Phantom Flex. Isn't it a, a cool piece of technology? Thank, Thank you, John. You. Very Thank smart you. as well. We do, and we now have a prize spot on the tree. This is the Power Shot by Canon. This is a 12.1 megapixel camera with your uh, burst mode on there as well. See, this is where being short doesn't really you want pay. me to help you there? I can help you. Can you? Toast. Yeah. There we go. Yeah. <laughs> You just hold my bum. Well, not obviously my bum, Ready? but you know what I mean. <laughs> okay, and relax. There we go. Oh, it almost came Fantastic. tumbling down. Thank you, Polly. Right, okay. So, we are now on the 11th day of Christmas. We're always there, almost there, ladies and gentlemen. Are you very excited about having a bit of a sing song? Uh, so, 11. If you're into your rock and roll, you'll know that you cannot play rock music at number 10 on the volume dial. It's got to be at number 11. And so, for that, we've had. A special amplifier constructed with number 11 on the dial. There we are. Okay. But no amplifier is complete without a rock guitarist and a guitar fed into it. Please give it up for Perry from Pendulum. <laughs> Let me just tell you something. I don't want to embarrass Perry, but Perry really is a proper rock god. Pendulum are a huge band. In fact, you're, you've performed in this venue all over the water, haven't you? Um, we've done a pretty few pretty big venues, yeah. Incredible. We've been, we've been really, you can yeah. see why with that sort of <laughs> action. So let, let me say something. Obviously, you're a very talented musician, but this is also a very clever guitar, the PV-80-200. That's right. It's the first guitar of its kind to, to use auto-tune technology. All right, okay. What so does basically, that mean? So basically, auto-tune is it detects pitch and then it manipulates it. So it can manipulate any pitch to any other pitch, basically. So ba uh, it, uh, it tunes things. Okay, so in order to make us understand that, how can, what can you demonstrate? Okay, um, t this guitar, it sounded in tune when I played then, but it's actually quite a lot out of tune. I've just, uh, I've switched the auto tune off now for you. Yeah. And this is what it actually sounds like. <laughs> it's awful, isn't but it? That's how I play. <laughs> so, so that guitar is well, it, out of tune. It's very much out of tune, but to tune it to standard tuning, that's all you do is strum the open strings like this and press the button. So you go. Wow! Isn't that cool? Yeah, that's pretty cool. So rather than spending 15 minutes twiddling around with these. these yeah, yeah. Uh, even you can do it as well. Shall you I, shall I show you? Do you want to test that theory? Yeah, okay, cool. Um, it's that button there. So it's that tune. And, and so, as well as also tuning, it, uh, this robotic guitar also plays other modes. Well, yeah, but, uh, but if you fret the, uh, the, uh, the strings at certain points, because it, uh, it, uh, it can trick the guitar to, think, uh, to make open tuning. So I put, put my finger there. I've got open D. No, sorry, drop D. Put my fingers here. You've got drop C. So it's now tuned to C, essentially. Yeah, so it's, it's proper heavy metal stuff. That, uh, but you can also uh, tune it to an open chord, like an open G. Uh, 
So the musicians amongst the audience will understand yeah, that. Yeah, Something sure. that I can connote, though, is, is that you can actually, uh, you can force it to be different types of guitars. That's that right, yes. Yeah. So the, uh, the really cool thing, you can make it sound like different electric guitars, a bass guitar. A bass? You can make it like a bass? Yeah, and even an acoustic guitar. So I can make it sound like an, uh, an acoustic 12-string, if you want, so. so. Here's some Pink Floyd for you. Okay, what if I was to throw Rolling Stones at you? Rolling Stones. Can you uh, do that? Yeah, yeah, I, I'll do. So now we've got the open, open G tuning again, and it's a bit of a cheat, so you only, only use one finger. It's what Keith Richards does. Wow. There you Absolutely go. amazing. I, I, isn't that incredible? Incredible. Perry and the uh, amazing PV8200. I reckon you should do some funky stuff. Are you up for it? Yeah. All right. Uh, Perry is going to be joined by Slow Mo, I believe, and also the Gadget Show Live Christmas Dancing Girls. Take it away, people. It's one, one, two, one, two, three, four. Girls and the brilliant slow mo. What about that? <laughs> incredible technology. It is incredible it? technology, but the best thing is, of course, we need to add a prize to the tree. Ladies and gentlemen, look at what you could win. This is the PV8200. This is worth hundreds of pounds. I, I don't know a I guitarist that wouldn't it. want that in their collection. Absolutely incredible. So, we are very nearly there, are we not? We are indeed. So, uh, we've kind of reached day 12, haven't we? But we're deciding to keep this on a musical vibe. So, we have our uber cool beatboxer. We've got Shlomo, um, and we've got Perry, who's just played the guitar for us. Now, on the original song, it was 12 drummers drumming. So we've decided to stick with that theme. So ladies and gentlemen, may I introduce to the stage an absolutely incredible drummer. It's Craig Blundell. So normally, as, as Polly said, it's 12 drummers drumming. We've got one drummer, but what we're going to do is use 12 drums, right? So. Craig's going to start off with one drum, which is the big one they're bringing in right now. That Roland device that he's got there is actually a sampler. He's going to use that to trigger uh, some samples. That's from Roland. They're actually in the hall, if you want to go and see their kit. This is an incredible piece of technology. You can actually sample, what's it, six hours of samples on this thing here? OK, but right now, one drum. And then our crew, slowly but surely, are going to bring in the rest of the drums until Craig is surrounded by, ten, uh, by 12 drums. Are you ready, mm -hmm. Craig? Then do your funky drummer stuff, baby. On the twelfth day of Christmas, my true love said to me,
Blundman, the veritably awesome Craig Blundell well and his 12 drummers drumming, or 12 drums drumming. Wow. Um, which completes day 12, apart from putting the marvellous prize on the tree, which continues the audio theme. It's a very splendid Orbit Sound T9 soundbar and iPod, and I don't know that I can reach, reach <laughs> up. on the floor, get down, John. Right? You reckon? Uh, yes. I'm going to put, yeah. put it down here, I think. Yes, right. so, <laughs> there we are. Now, in a moment, we are going to reveal the lucky person from the audience who has won the marvellous collection of prizes that is the Gadget Show Christmas tree. Everyone's going to cheer, it's all going to be wonderful, and Polly's going to uh, collapse with excitement like you did in rehearsals. I wondered what you were yes. going to say then. Right. <laughs> <laughs> okay, well of course we have now got our 12 days of Christmas, which is quite exciting. So this is the crescendo of the show, and this is either going to be utterly brilliant, or completely flat. Yeah, one of the two, but either way, we're going with it. <laughs> okay, so uh, is everyone on stage, first of all? Yeah? Okay, you guys are happy, you're good. Shlomo, you're ready. Perry, you're getting funky, baby. I know you got it going on, baby. And the girls with the twirlies and the rubber chase and the whole thing. Right, and are you ready? Are you ready to sing with us? Okay, on your feet, everybody, on your feet. This stand up, ladies and gentlemen, if you can. If you can, please stand up. Okay, so what we're going to do is go through the song, The 12 Days of Christmas. Uh -huh. The words are going to be coming up on that screen. That's very important because it's going to move relatively quickly. Just give it your best shot. And remember, we're going to start at 12, working our way all the way down to 1. Okay, so, slow mo Starting with, on the 12th day of Christmas, my true love sent to me. Thank Those you, John. The opening boy. words. Okay. We're with you, Bandmaster. <laughs> Turn it up to eleven. So wait a second. Pain is nine. A windows eight. Seven AR cubes. Six twirling back on five. R C rings. Plus dance for five pads. Three D two. Jason Crabbe and a one. So uh, that's it, guys. Yeah. Thank you so much well, for joining in. I hope Cheers. you really, really have enjoyed the show. And thank you to all of our amazing artists as well that have kind of made the 12 days I think of it's Christmas. been an absolutely incredible show. Thank you. I think that's well deserved. Some of the most talented people we've ever put on a Gadget Show live stage. It's been awesome. Well, what can I say? It's been nine years of crazy gadget fun. And from the bottom of our hearts, thank you so much for being so loyal and supporting us. All that remains to be said is... Everybody, Merry, Merry, Christmas. Merry Christmas! Have a great show, ladies and gentlemen! Woo!
snow.